Good morning vlog. It is a bright day outside today. Let's see if I can angle it up so you can see the sky. Nope, it is just it's just that bright outside you can't even see. Today I'm heading over to RBS Gogerburn. It is the last day I'm gonna be there for a while. Um the programme I'm in is coming to an end and this is the last workshop. I've been going there frequently over the last few months. It's been good being a part of the programme, I've enjoyed it. Um, I did have the opportunity to progress onto the next stage, which is called Enablement. But I decided not to at the moment because there's stuff I want, I want to do in the business, stuff I want to rework um, and figure out where we're, a, a more long-term plan. Um, specifically, like, we want to redevelop our entire sort of business automation system. So, if you've ever used our platform, um, we want to completely, like, rework it basically. And uh, I'm gonna go over there today and then it's morning and uh, it's the last workshop so it all should be pretty fun. So let's go on the train. Well good afternoon and hello there vlog. I am outside in this lovely greenery that is behind me on both sides. Uh, yeah I have just come out of the uh, RBS building in Gogerburn. Uh, last Entrepreneurial Spark workshop and sessions are done. Uh, that's me finished with the first part of the program. I could have went on to apply for the second stage, because there's like four stages. But at the moment, I've chosen to wait until um, for, we're a bit further on with things. But hopefully in the future we'll apply to join the second stage of the program. I am walking to the tram stop now because I'm going one, I really need something to eat. And I want to go to the Guile Centre because the tram there, because I want to go to the Costa. I walk here, the trams come this way from the airport. And there's a tram coming that way actually, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go this way and avoid that tram, like so. Okay, I made it, uh, I went a couple of stops on the tram, I'm now at the Guile Centre. I'm going to go to the Costa because, like I said, I want lunch. <laughs> and then I'm going to go to Krispy Kreme because they do a really good banana and banoffee smoothie. Mm. You know something, this morning, so I was coming over, and uh, I'll tell this story. <laughs> I was coming over on the train, and I got on the train at the train pulled away, and then they announced, because this train is delayed, we're going to skip every station after Inverkeithing between here and Edinburgh. I was like, oh great, I was supposed to get off Edinburgh Gateway. Guess I won't be doing that. So, I ended up having to go to get off Inverkeithing, and then luckily there's the airport bus, which goes over this way. Jumped on that, and then I had to change the Ingolston Park and ride onto the 35 bus. Like, local bus to go into Gorburn. And as soon as I got off, off comes the 35, jump on, go to the Gogerburn, and I made it just in time. With like a second to spare, basically. <laughs> so, it all worked out. But thanks a lot, Scott Rail. Would you just look at those blinds? Guys, let's go outside and see you outside, okay? Yeah, let's do that. Look how pretty it is outside. That is just... Beautiful. So nice and just a nice looking sky right there. It's not actually that cold too. It is a beautiful evening in Scotland. And uh, we are just enjoying the beauty of the evening. Are you enjoying the beauty of the evening, family? <laughs> Got him! <laughs> There's a bird just chilling in our garden. He just knocked on the window. Like we were sitting through, we were sitting through the other room, and there was knocks on the window, and there's just a bird. It's a pretty big bird. No, was that a seagull? Cool. It is a 
beautiful evening, isn't it? Um, it's like nine o'clock at night. I'm out, I'm wearing my uh, hoodie, um, and I'm walking to my local shop. I'm angling the camera a bit weird because I want you to see the sky, and also, you know, just it's a beautiful night. You see the trees up there, and it's actually like I guess it's like springtime. Like the sun is still out. That's a street light you can see, but like. The sun is still out, basically. The sun's still setting. It's like 9 p.m. at night. This is one of the reasons why I like, I love Scotland at this time of year. Because it's just, it's really nice. It's really, like, you get really long days. And it's great. And I love it. And it's actually only going to get lighter at night. Like, there's points in the summer, like towards like July, where end of, sorry, end of, Ju end of May, June, where it actually the sun doesn't finish setting till like after midnight. It's pretty crazy. <laughs> you should, you gotta be there to see it. And then the sun will rise again at like 4 a.m. kind of times. It's pretty cool. But I'm off to my local shop because I need to uh, stock up on, uh, on the alcoholic beverages so I have some to enjoy. Uh, yeah, just gonna get some cider. Maybe, maybe a little cake. Mm. <laughs> okay, that was weird. Anyway. What up vlog? It's a new day. The sun is not as shining as yesterday. Like look, the sky is just kinda grey today. Definitely not not a nice not as nice as it was yesterday. Meh. But that doesn't matter because today we are heading uh, well I'm heading with my parents, We're going to hang out at a um fundraiser for a Fife Gymnastics Club, which my uh little cousins are part of and my and is on like the committee or chairs of the committee or does something for them. I don't really remember. Sorry. I'm coming. I'm just explaining to the vlog what I'm doing. <laughs> I would, but it just it's easier to do it in here, you know. I'll be right back. As I was saying previously, um, we're heading up to uh, a fundraiser for a Hive Gymnastic thing. And uh, yeah, it uh, should be pretty fun. There'll be a bunch of my family there. And uh, my uncle's band are playing there as well, so it's kind of like a family affair thing. Uh, but yeah, we be pretty good. Uh, we're heading up to Glen Ross to a Balmarney House Hotel, I think is a place. Uh, so, I'll see you guys there. Hmm, this is a really nice area here. Got a bush behind me. Hmm. Pretty nice. Just hear the birds. Very tranquil. I think there's a golf course here too. Look at that lot of Scottish country dancing! the dancing. In fact, we're, we're, we're going to need another three over here as well. Come on, ladies and gentlemen, this is a party after all. I have no idea. <laughs> Hopefully, you guys can hear him. <laughs> <Is that okay? laughs> this must be the only so place in the world three? where when you go up to dance, the DJ gives you instructions. Have we got another three? <laughs> And the so idea is that you can make your way around all the other sexes. Okay. So everybody has to get told how to do it. Just for the newcomers here, that was that was best to be told by this in the middle of the party. You're right, and set to the partner. <laughs> and turn them. Set to your other partner.
tea, darling, but I don't know how to work it. How do you use them? <laughs> Good as tablet and biscuits. Ooh, we thought they were wee cakes, but they're not. It's just tablet and biscuits. I got to the food late because uh, I've already eaten, but... I'm definitely not that hungry. Maybe just have some tablet. <laughs> Should, probably shouldn't have ate before I came. Take a look at this box. It was here the whole time and I didn't even know. It had biscuits in it and stuff. And tablet. I'm gonna take this one. Yummy. Right, Grandma. Right. What do you What do you think this is? What do you think this is? Smell this! What I do! But there's something else in it! Like give it a try! You got it? No. It's got whiskey in it! It's got it's got whiskey in it! Sunday, yay Sunday, and I've come out for lunch with the family. <laughs> and I, have these. I don't really want you to do that. These are hey, get off my food. <laughs> so this is this is this is a small one. This is haggis with uh, some kind of cheddar and chutney, and uh, these things. And this looks really good. Well, I am back home. Yeah. And uh, I just need to get changed because I'm still... I was at the gym earlier before I went for lunch. And basically, I'm still wearing shorts. Hey! Look how hairy my legs are. Look how hairy they are. So, um, anyway. Anyway, I was at the, uh, I was at the gym earlier. And uh, then, um, as, while I was at the gym, my, my mum was uh, teaching some classes there. So I, after walked down with her, went to the gym. Afterwards, met up with her. And my dad came down and we went to a local cafe for lunch. And it's really shaky because I'm not using the Osmo, but, you know, hey, hi there, goodbye. But anyway, I need to get changed and we get ready because we're going down to a family barbecue because it's my cousin's birthday and apparently we're having a barbecue. So, you know, why not? Okay. Anyway, I'm going to get changed. I'm going to do that and then we'll go down now. Okay, bye. Oh, oh, that's going to be a Oh, here we go. Get the fire. <laughs> 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 oh, we're right. Oh, we're today. We're right. We're okay this time. Douglas, what are you doing? How do you feel about the fire pit? <laughs> Great. It's a bit smoky. It's a wee bit smoky. Callum looks super chill over there. Oh, crackle. What's that, the crackle? That's a real fire. Harry's uh, topped it up with just a lot of gasoline right there, so we're expecting a giant, uh, giant fire coming up here. Let's see what happens. Oh, there goes a the paper plate. <laughs> One <laughs> more. Hey, excuse the door, get the table, eh? It's really going now. Happy birthday to Callum. Happy birthday to Callum. Happy birthday, dear Callum. Happy birthday to you. Is it gonna light? We'll find out. Stay tuned. Maybe we'll need to do it inside. There it goes. <laughs> 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 I'm done! <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> blow the other one out. <laughs> well, good afternoon, vlog. Happy Monday. Yeah, okay, whatever. I am uh, I'm at a train station. Um, I've come to a place called Kirkcaldy. If you don't know what Kirkcaldy is, it's just a, it's a town, basically. Nothing special. Anyway, I had a meeting here. Now I'm just heading back. See, my uh, dad is getting a new car out this way uh, this afternoon um, when he's finished. Then he's going to pick me up in his new car. So that should be pretty cool. Ooh, fancy. Open up. Open up. Open up. Open up. This looks fancy. What up? How's that new car smell? Does it? Yeah. Oh, it's blue. I thought there was leather seats. There's leather. Feel them. It doesn't feel like. Well, I was thinking shiny leather. Ew. What do you mean, ew? There's no car with shiny seats. Yeah. There's not. Yeah, there is. I've seen some. <laughs> 